with another video and I'm here to tell you guys about my new hair. Oh gosh. I really, really like this. So this is a wig that I bought from Dress Lily. I bought it for under 20 bucks. Um, so yeah, let's get into it. If you want to know a little more about this little affordable little wig from Dress Lily, stay tuned. So anyways, let's get started on how I wound up finding about the way and then we'll get into the purchase and then the time it took to get to me and all of that other stuff. So I originally um, wanted a wig because I like wigs. <laughs> and for two, I needed to find something that was really, really affordable because I'm on a tight budget. So I was searching around, searching around, couldn't really find anything on my own. So one day I was browsing on YouTube and I found a delightful, beautiful young woman that was showcasing some wigs for under 20 bucks um, by the name of Daquana White. I stumbled upon Daquana White's channel and she was rocking the heck out of this particular wig. I think she had um, four or five, I don't know how many wigs, but this particular one appealed to me the most. So I was like, I got to get that. I got to get this wig because it was so cute on her. So um, shout out to you, Daquana. I really love this wig. So um, like I said, I stumbled upon her channel, wound up subscribing to her right after that. So a little bit after that, I went ahead and placed an order with Tress Lily and I bought the wig. Let me see how much the wig actually costed, like in total. Because I think I paid a little extra for shipping. So let me see. The wig was $13.69. But I paid an extra $10 for, um, I guess it's like express shipping or standard shipping or what have you. So I paid an extra $10. So I paid $23 in all. Now you can go ahead and just take the flat rate and pay the $13.69 if you want. But it'll probably take you a while to get your wig. Um, at least probably I'm thinking a month or so. So anyways, I went ahead and placed the order for my wig. I'm going to give you guys a good, bad, and be ugly because, you know, I got a little frustrated, but just movie got it together. Okay, they got it together. So anyways, <clears throat> placed the order, paid my 10 extra bucks to get my wig within six to eight days, okay? That was the delivery time I was supposed to receive it in. So some time goes on and let me go check to see where my order is. It hasn't went anywhere. So with Dress Lily, with some purchases, you may not receive any shipping information and with some you will. With mine, I received my tracking information. So let me tell y'all about Dress Lily. So I ordered, my order time was September 15th, 2016 at 10, 11 a.m. Okay, they give you the time too. So I ordered it on September the 15th. They did not ship, I'm sorry, they did not receive, it says received data. My received data did not come in until the 20th of September. So it took them five days just to receive my order information. So I was like, okay, hmm. Why did it take you guys five days? Maybe they have a high volume of orders. Okay, okay, so you guys, it took them, let me see. So I ordered on the 15th of September and I got mine on the 1st of October, which means it took two whole weeks for me to get my order. It took them five days just to receive my information. Dress Lily. Why am I paying a whole extra $10 for that? That was so pointless, okay? But I would say I wouldn't take that back because if I wouldn't have gotten that shipping that I did get, it probably would have took me a lot longer to receive my order. But I will say they were, for me personally, they did really well with interacting when I sent them messages and asking where my things were. But I never knew exactly where my package was. It never said like what state or anything like that. So that was really confusing. Um, but anyways, I did get my package and they did respond to my inquiries and, and you know, my concerns. So I will say that. Yes, yeah, so anyways, um, it did get here and I was very thrilled. So 
it came and it came in um it had it was inside of another white plastic um bag and then inside of that there was this okay i kept this piece so it's just like a big ziploc bag um and then it was inside of a net okay um a cat net knitted cat whatever you want to call it and it had some type of bar i put on this nothing too fancy okay um, I wasn't really concerned about that as long as my wig was intact. I pulled it out in the wig. I loved it. I loved the wig. Now this wig, you're going to get what you're paying for. You're going to pay 13, 14 bucks for this. So that's what you're going to get. Um, it is simply made. There's no party in it or anything like that. You have to kind of custom fit it for you and the way that you like it. So that's what I did. I did a little bit, I did a little bit of trimming and cutting, nothing too major. I probably need to do a little bit more, but I just kind of wanted you guys to get the feel of how the wig looks. I hope you all. It's getting hot in here, y'all. I'm gonna take off this jacket. Ugh. Anyways, so yeah, I ordered the wig. I forgot where I left off, y'all. I got cut off, okay? So, um, yeah, I received my package and I loved it. I did the parting, I'm sorry, I did the cutting and all of that stuff and it turned out to be a very, very lovely unit. Um, I combed it out. Of course, you need to, you know, get some type of um, flat brush and comb it out. You know, give it some body and do whatever it is that you like and whatever your preference is and sculpt it to your face, all that good stuff. I'm not a pro when it comes to cutting hair and styling wigs and all of that stuff. I just do what I think looks good on me and what I think looks really good and this turned out really nice for me um I'm going to be purchasing more um you know more wigs that are affordable and that are within my budget until I can get some more you know what I'm saying virgin hair but this is really really cute I got compliments on this hair I really do love it and I'm thinking about actually ordering more hair from Dress Lily. I'm a little bit nervous because I have seen people complain about not getting their orders and I have seen people complain about getting their orders and then the products really not being what it looks like in the picture. Um, with Dress Lily, it's an Asian based site so it's not always going to look exactly like the picture but it's it, it's going to be similar, okay? And mine was similar enough, um, but some people's were just totally off the charts and totally not even what the picture looked like. Um, for whatever reason, I was fortunate enough to get, I guess, a good batch, okay? Good wig, and I love it. And um, it feels very light, feathery. The way it should be, it's not too full and not too thin. It's perfect, pretty much. Um, and since you don't have the party, you have to kind of maneuver the hair and, you know, make it what you want it, okay? Um, make it what you want it to be. But if you guys want um, to see what Daquana's hair looked like, because hers was fabulous. But yeah, guys, if you would like to see Daquana's video, I'm going to leave a link below for you guys to click on it and watch her video. That is the video that made me choose this wig. And you guys, please go check out her channel, okay? I would highly, highly recommend you go look at her channel. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. I hope that you like my wig. <laughs> Shake it around a little for you guys. It moves. Yes, it does. Um, and until the next time, bye-bye, guys.